guys, this is the hike to Pumpkin Rock, which is right there. Um, it's pretty easy, it's about a mile and a half round trip, uh, straight uphill, I need to go straight back downhill. Uh, but it's fun, it's kind of weird and funky, and it's, uh, you know, not in the middle of nowhere, so it's easy to do. It's kind of family friendly, it's definitely doable for kids, but there's a lot of broken glass and beer bottles and that kind of stuff here, so I wouldn't let them crawl around. If you do want to do it, go to hikingguy.com, I have all the directions there and uh, parking information too. There's a few places to park. I list the most popular place to park. Uh, it's also close to bathrooms. So anyway, Pumpkin Rock, this is how you do it. Have fun. So there's a couple ways to get to Pumpkin Rock. These directions are for the probably the most popular way and it starts at the equestrian center. You can see there's lots of parking here. Just be careful for no parking signs. And the trailhead's real easy to spot. It's right at the end of the parking lot here. So you're just gonna head up the trail from here there's some signs here, but uh, not really used for anything. This park's seen uh, better days, I think. But there are horses, mountain bikes, so keep your eyes open. The trail's wide. As you go up, you're going to see Pumpkin Rock up in the distance there as you climb. There's some smaller side trails. Just stay on the main trail and keep going up here. Pretty straightforward. Now, at the first junction of a big trail, you're going to make the left. If you go straight, you're gonna see these horses, these cool horse sculptures over there. You can check that out on the way down, but for now, we're just gonna make the left and keep heading uphill towards Pumpkin Rock. And once you go up, there's a junction of a bunch of trails, so five or six trails uh, meet here where these boulders are. It's almost right after that last turn, but you're gonna keep going straight through here in the trail kind of twists around to the right and goes up there, as you can see. Then shortly after that, the trail tees into another one. You're going to head left. You can see it goes down there, but you're going to head left and keep on going up towards Pumpkin Rock. After this section, the trail gets a little narrow for a while. It's more like a real trail as opposed to a dirt road, but you're going to go through there and keep climbing, going up towards uh, the rock. You'll see some mountain bike trails and some uh, footprints, you know, just stay on the main trail. You can see here is a side trail that goes off. Just stay on this main trail, which is pretty easy to spot. After this narrow section, you're gonna come up to the next big intersection. Uh, that's where the uh, other main trail up here comes in bunch of boulders. You're going to go straight through here. This is the last little section up to the, the summit. And once you go through here, you can see there's the trail off to the side, but you can basically go straight up for the little last little section here. And uh, you will start to see Pumpkin Rock looming in the distance. You'll see the equestrian center down below where you started. Now, when you get up to the rock, that's it. Uh, you can check it out. You can see some awesome views into uh, Norco and Corona, all the area there. But there's Pumpkin Rock. I have all the information on the rock on the blog site, so just head to hikingguy.com to learn more about it and why it's there and all that jazz. You can climb around the boulders. There's some broken glass and garbage. Just be careful. Um, if you do want to hike some more, there's a lot more trails here in the complex. I would recommend just going up this Norco Ridge Trail, which is right there. You can head up there and get some nice views. It's all pretty small, so uh, easy to navigate. But if you want to go back, you just head back down the trail the way you came up, and that's the hike. So have fun. Hey, guys, if you liked the video uh, and you're on YouTube, can you please like the video? And if you want to share it, leave a comment if you have a question. And uh, I would appreciate that very much. That will help other people find these directions. Happy trails.